Good morning to everybody. In this video, we will test a uh, data center firewall to communicate from inside to outside, outside to inside, from DMC to inside, and outside to DMC. Okay, but before that, we need to configure the IP route on the core switch. Okay, so as you can see here, I have a uh, IP route that already created. I will just copy this. So let's see. And then here on the CLI of EVNG, you have to to control press control alt shift and then paste here the route that I want to add. This is the way how you will copy from Notepad to the CLI of the EVNG switches. This is the way how you will do it. So click ticks input and then from here config T. And then right click and then paste. Okay. So now IP route is okay. As you can see, control that chip. I will click none. We will test first the connectivity. For example, from the core, from the core switch, I will ping this PC. So ping 1072.3. So it's reachable. So it means the traffic from this core going to the outside interface, which is this 1072.2, is allowing the firewall to reach to the PC okay I will I will ping the second one 23.3 so it's switchable and also if I will ping this DMC PC 25 that let's try so it's everything is switchable and also we will go to the PC from the inside okay this PC so this PC 20 23 2.3 try to ping so as you can see it can ping the internet 8.8.8.8 so the traffic is coming from this one going to the to the data center switch and then going to the firewall going to the core and then go into the palo alto internet firewall and then go to the internet okay so if you will click the browser so we'll test to search to the internet. So I will just click my place Palawan. Okay. Philippines. We'll see if you can the PC can search to the internet. As you can see, the internet is working from the inside. Okay. Okay. Let's test how about how about from this PC. We'll ping from this PC going to this PC 22.3 okay so open this we'll go it we'll put it here so we'll ping it 22.3 then that's 70.22.3 that so which is the traffic is from this outside PC going to this 22.3 okay And, and you can see this working fine how about this dmc pc okay i'll put it here okay let's ping the google okay ping that google.com so you can see it is working fine how about let's search to the internet As you can see it is working fine okay it will be able to search to the internet the dmc pc which is this one okay also the next thing we have to do is as a network administrator most of the time our pc is here on the outside of the data center firewall so our pc is connected outside so we will modify this fmc so that we can access the gateway of this one so that we can access from the outside going to the inside because currently you cannot access that so we have to come into this fmc pc and then we will change the gateway so maximize and then go to system
Okay. Yeah, to in order to change the gateway of the FMC, because what I did on the when we set up this one, um, we configure the the data center switch and then we we tell to the FMC that the default gateway would be the uh, data center switch. Now we'll tell to FMC that the default gateway will be the sub interface on the Cisco FTD, which is 10.7024.1. So, if you will open the <coughs> system, and then you will go to IP routes. So, you need to change this one to that one. Okay. And then press OK. And then save. save and then the uh, and then on the bottom you will see the save okay once you press the save you are good to go and then we will test the the gui so what we will do after this we will access the fmc using this pc from the outside okay i will just save and then i will proceed for testing Okay, we will save. Yes. So, and that's it. After saving, you don't need to deploy. Okay. So, what we will do now, we'll go to the pol topology. We'll, so, our goal is, for example, we are outside the data center. How will we be able to manage the firewall? So now I already changed the default gateway of the FMC so that we can communicate via firewall. Okay, I will open this PC and then I will use the browser. In order to let this PC able to manage the 107024.6, which is the FMC, we need to create a policy here on the FTD telling that from outside going to the uh, management VLAN okay so we'll double click this so on the policy we will add one more policy okay so from outside to MGT MGT VLAN okay so we will select the source will be outside going to i also write it there going to inside wait a minute i'll double check the ping i think we don't need to create the policy because it's already on the inside zone this fmc so we'll just double click the this pc and then try to ping okay as you can see it is switchable now we'll access via gui Click advance and then proceed. Then log in admin admin one two three. Click proceed. Click log in again. As you can see using this PC, using this PC the outside PC. From this side, 1073.5, it can manage now the FMC. What, what we we only change the default gateway of this FMC on the system. I think that's um, this is the end of this configuration of the firewall of the data center. Uh, on the next video, um, I will show to you the this one. I will create the DHCP server and also a domain the domain controller so that when we plug a pc uh, it will automatically get an ip okay and also when we log into the windows we will use the windows credential